Monaco may have blown hot and cold in an already tumultuous season, but since beating PSG 3 0 in round 29, Philip Clermont's men have been on song. They welcome Trois to the Stade Louis Du while targeting a third successive league win. Wissam Ben Yedder with two goals to make up as Kylian Mbappe hit the 20 goal mark the day before. Yedder stack unbeaten in the last five Ligue 1 Uber Eats games and could equal their longest unbeaten run in their history in the top flight. Yet they were hesitant and almost punished. Ben Yedder unable to punish the visitors on that occasion. Cal Henrik in linking with Alexander Golovin. Anderson tried his luck from distance. But it was a fellow Brazilian who would do even better. An absolute rocket that had Monaco dancing. His last goal came in January 2022. And that kicked off a 4 0 win against Clermont. They would have hoped for similar. Only for Trois to strike back. Kissing the post on its way in. Ike Ugbo with his third goal since arriving at the end of the winter transfer market. A goal in each month now for the young Canadian international. February, March and now April. Monaco pegged back. Trois could make it three away wins in a row for the first time in the top flight since January 2001. While Monaco had scored... 16 goals over the last seven home games. Ben Yedder has scored in 50 different games in Liga Nuberis this season, more than any other player, but was finding it tough going in the Monaco Sun. Well, Myron Boadu off, Kevin Folland on. The German hasn't rediscovered the form that brought 16 goals last season. Sent on, though, to make an impact. He didn't even wait a full minute. Touch and finish. Scoring in successive games, just sixth of the season, but also now a centurion has fallen, hit his 100th goal in top five European leagues. 33 with Hoffenheim, 44 with Leverkusen, now 23 with Monaco. Yasser Larouchi off the bench, slotted the ball down to Javier Chevalerin. And Ugbo thought he was in again. Instead, it was Monaco who earned a third straight win to end Trois' unbeaten run. A stack, though, five points above the bottom three, whereas the Principality now right in the fight for Europe. Two points from fourth, six from the podium.